In this video, I'm gonna demo a tool that will build an entire website and brand and all of the design for you off of a single idea, just one prompt. Let's dig in. So if we come over here to future tools and we type in a web design and narrow it down, there's a handful of web design tools in here. The one I wanna focus in on today is this tool called Mixo. M-I-X-O. So let's take a peek at this one here. With this tool, it says you can launch a startup in seconds with AI and you can get started for free. Now, instead of reading the landing page, let's just dive in and take a look at what it's capable of. So let's click get started for free and it'll bring us to this question that says, what's your startup idea? You don't even have to have a name for your company yet. You can just come here and type in the idea for a startup. So let's just plug in a random idea. Let's just say a Chrome extension that uses AI to search Twitter and find relevant questions to answer for your brand and click generate site. And then watch, it's gonna go through all these kind of like things here, connecting to AI, submitting description, generating a startup name, designing a logo, collecting site images, crafting testimonials, <laughs> writing site copy, generating site code, configuring site. It's literally doing all of this stuff behind the scenes off of just one prompt, optimizing SEO. And here we go, it built an entire site here. It picked a brand name called Quick Tweet Searcher, reach customers with AI powered search, a Chrome extension that uses AI to search Twitter and find relevant questions to answers for your brand. And then let's take a peek at the website that it generated for us. Quick Tweet Searcher, so it's got the brand name at the top, reach customers with AI powered search. It put images here, it put in opt-in form to join our wait list here, put the description of the tool here, it generated a testimonial. Quick Tweet Searcher has revolutionized how I find relevant questions to answer. Olivia Vela, and then it put a headshot in there which I believe was probably AI generated or it's a stock image. Improve your customer service. Quick Tweet Searcher helps you to quickly find customer questions and provide answers to boost your customer service and branding. Reach potential customers. With Quick Tweet Searcher, you can easily find potential customers who are searching questions relevant to your brand and reach out to them. Got another testimonial down here that it auto generated. This extension has made it so much easier to reach potential customers. Down here, it's got a call to action. Join our community of fans that love Quick Tweet Searcher. So pretty cool, but let's say I wanna customize this even more. I can click over here and save and customize, and then it's gonna ask you to log in. So let's go ahead and sign in with Google real quick. And now it's saving the site into my own dashboard here. And now we're presented with the option to pay. It's $9 a month or $39 a month, but we can actually play around with this without paying yet. So let's go ahead and click on continue with just the free plan. And you can see here's our site and we've got a whole page builder here. So if we open up the site, you can see this is the logo that it generated. It's purple and gray. Here's the site name. We can change the brand if we want our site title, the site description that shows up right here. We can tweak all of that. We even created our site social share image, the open graph image for this product. Let's see what happens when we change the colors here. You can see it shifts the colors here on the website. So if we want more blues for our colors, it'll change the whole website, put more of these blues throughout the website. We can customize any of this. If we don't like the name, we can change the name. We've got our hero image up here. You can see we've got, this is where the title is, reach customers with AI powered search. So we can tweak this text here. We've got our subtitle, which shows up right here. At the primary button, we've got our sign up form here where we can change this text, join our wait list. We can change the text on the button there, join the wait list. We've got a real, real easy page editor. We've got features. So feature one is improve your customer service. You can see that it generated this for improve your customer service. If I uncheck this, it'll hide that section. Check it again, it'll bring it back. We've got our image here. We can swap out the image if we want, or we can use the one that it automatically generated for us. Feature two, reach potential customers. We can hide this one here if we want, bring it back. We can add a third feature in here if we want, show this third feature. Let's say, grow your Twitter following. Look at that, it added this headline here. Down here, we've got testimonials. You can see that it pulled in this testimonial. We can change it with a real one when we go live. This is just kind of filler content. We've got an FAQ section, which is currently hidden, but if I show the section, you can add an FAQ to the page just that easily. It already added a few FAQ questions that you could use and just write your response to. You've got your call to action down here at the bottom. Join our community of fans that love quick tweet searcher. We could hide the avatar images if we want. We could bring them back. We could change the primary button, change the sign up form. We can add a note section down here at the bottom. Let's see what that does. A note from our founder, and we can add some extra text down here, add an image URL if you want, but it's pretty cool. 
Now let's scroll up to the top here and let's just publish our site. One moment, we're performing some magic, building the site. There we go. We have a site that is published and ready to go. Now, if I click on this, you can see here is my example site, quick tweet searcher with my text, with my opt-in form here, with our feature list. All of this was designed for me and the only prompt I typed in was a Chrome extension that uses AI to search Twitter and find relevant questions for your brand to answer. That's all I typed in and it created this entire site, the title, the logo, the images, the text, the opt-in form, all of it. And you know what's even cooler? Check this out. Let's just go ahead and put in Matt at futuretools.io and join the waitlist. Success, we'll be in touch soon. So I just joined the waitlist here. Now if I go back to my site dashboard and you can see here's quick tweet searcher. If I scroll down here, check this out. Recent subscribers, one subscriber. So it actually added my email address to the list. So it's actually a functioning website where if somebody opts in, it'll save the email address and you can download your subscribers later and you know move them over to whatever autoresponder you want. Now, earlier I did show you that you can upgrade for $9 a month or $39 a month. The $9 a month lets you get that custom domain name. It lets you export your subscribers. You can integrate Google Analytics and it removes that Mixo branding that was down in the bottom right corner. So see this down in the bottom right hand corner? When you sign up, it's actually gonna remove that for you. And then for the $39 a month plan, you can launch up to 15 sites. And if I wanted to customize the domain name, it'll also ask me to upgrade here. Or if I wanted to add Google Analytics to it and disable the badge, it'll ask me to upgrade. But here's what I really like about Mixo. Mixo is the perfect validation tool. Let's say you have an idea for a software product and you don't know if you should build it or not. You wanna get some validation to find out if other people would actually use that product or it's something that's actually in demand. Well, what you can do is you can sign up for Mixo, plug in the idea for your product. You don't even have to have a name yet. You don't even have to have a domain name for it yet. You just have to have an idea for a product that you want. You plug in that idea, you go to Mixo, you build a quick landing page, and then you can go and drive traffic to it. You can run Facebook ads or Google ads or share it on Twitter or Facebook or Reddit or wherever you wanna drive traffic. And if you get people opting in for it, you get people joining that wait list, then you've validated the product. You now know that people are actually interested in that product. This to me is the perfect way to validate a concept for any sort of software, or let's say you have an educational course you're thinking about creating or a service you're thinking about offering, and you don't wanna go out and offer it yet until you know that people are actually going to want it or want to buy it. Well, this is what you use. You go and create a quick page that takes you literally minutes with Mixo, and it does everything for you, and then you just drive traffic to it, and then once you know that people want it, you go and actually build the product. So that's what I love about Mixo. You can find this tool by going to futuretools.io, coming up to the search box, typing in web design, and you'll see this tool along with a handful of other tools that'll help you with web design as well as product validation on top of hundreds of other tools that leverage cool AI technology. So check out futuretools.io. You're gonna find a ton of really cool tools there that you probably never even thought could exist. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the newsletter as well. Come over to futuretools.io, click on the join the free newsletter button. And every single Friday, I'm gonna send you my five favorite tools that I came across for the week. I'm gonna send you three really interesting news articles in the AI space, three really cool YouTube videos that I know you're gonna dig, and one cool way to make money using AI. I send it every single Friday. And if you join the list, I'll make sure you get this Fridays. So thanks so much for tuning in this video. Hope you enjoyed this super quick overview of a cool tool that I came across that I think you'd like. If you want more tools like this, make sure you like this video and subscribe to this channel. That will ensure that you see more stuff in your feed like this. And thanks so much for tuning in. I really appreciate you nerding out with me today. See you guys in the next video.